Well, in NCAA volleyball action tonight, number two, San Diego ended Kentucky season in Palo Alto, California in the Sweet 16. The Wildcats simply ran into a buzzsaw. San Diego came into the game on a 26 match win streak. Let's head to the highlights. UK took an early lead in the first set. It was 10 to 7, but San Diego used a 7 to 2 run to take a four point lead. They held off the Cats in the first 25 to 22. Reagan Rutherford had four kills to lead the Cats in the first. In the second set, the Toreros raced out to a 10 5 lead. The Wildcats simply couldn't catch up. They got as close as 18 to 16, but San Diego closed out the set on a 5 0 run. They took set 2 25 19. The third set uh, played out much like the first two. Cats had an early lead, but again, a 4-0 run put the Toreros up 11-7. They would go on to win 25-18. Adonna Rollins led UK with 11 kills. Emma Grome posted 31 assists. Kentucky finishes the season with a 22-8 record and its sixth straight SEC championship. The Wildcats made the NCAA tourney for the 18th straight season under Craig Skinner and also posted 20 wins or more for the 12th straight year. All right, so do you want the good news first or the bad news in UK football? Okay, Chris Rodriguez becomes the second huge offensive player to skip the Music City Bowl, following his quarterback Will Levis yesterday. C-Rod finishes his career with 3,644 yards, third on the all-time rushing list, behind only Benny Stell and Sonny Collins. His 2,100-yard rushing games are the most of any back to ever wear the blue and white. He says he's going to go to the game and watch and cheer his brothers on. Well, how about the good news? The Wildcats picked up their first commitment through the portal, and it's a big one. Alabama offensive lineman Tanner Bowles, a 6'5", 295-pound offensive lineman, says he's coming home. Bowles from Glasgow, Kentucky, played four seasons at Alabama, appearing in 19 games for the Crimson Tide. He's a redshirt senior. He has two years of eligibility left. Coming out of high school, Bowles it was a five-star recruit. He chose Alabama over UK, Tennessee, LSU, and Oklahoma. Well, three UK freshman football players were named to the SEC all freshman team today. Wide receiver Barryon Brown, offensive lineman Jagger Burton, and defensive lineman Dion Walker. Brown led the Wildcats with 45 receptions for 604 yards and four touchdowns. He averaged 13 and a half yards a catch. He also led the team in kick returns, averaging more than 28 yards a return with one touchdown. Lexington native Jagger Burton started all 12 games at left guard, becoming the first freshman since Zach West to start 12 games in his first season. And then this guy right there, big Deion Walker, the 6'6", 335 pounder from Detroit. He continues to rack up postseason accolades. Walker was named the Pro Football Focus True Freshman All-American Team and the College Football News All-American Team. All three are cornerstones for the future of the program. And finally, speaking of football, we've got the Music City Bowl right here on ABC 36. We get things started with our year in review at 1030. Then it's our preview show starting at 11 live from Nashville. The game kicks off at 12 noon. You can see all of that right here. New Year's Eve day starting, as I said, there at 1030. Well, that's it for sports this Friday morning. I hope you have a great rest of your day.